action, we are first educated with some type of information that inspires us to act. So what were they taught? Yes, ma'am. So one thing they may have been talking about the nonviolent philosophy. That's one. Yes, sir. That their actions would make a difference. Their actions would make a difference. One more person. What about what they told the actions? Yes. So a couple more people. Yes, sir. And collectively, their actions would make a difference. So they were told that the actions would make a difference. They were given information about the nonviolent movement. Collectively, their actions make a difference. And yes, ma'am. They understood. So in order for them to be inspired. To want to take this action, there has to necessarily be information. There had to be a foundation of what they received in order for them to take that next step. Does it make sense? And we're looking at how do we inspire that in our classrooms amongst with our young people and to cause them to want to make systemic change in their society. I realized I didn't introduce myself, but I just jumped up. You know, I teach I just started teaching. <laughs> My name is Tandra Burkett, and I have been a social studies educator now for the past 25 years. I have shifted from the classroom. I worked in New York City. I worked in the Bronx. I worked in Brooklyn. I worked in Harlem. And I transitioned from the classroom to go into doing educational consulting. Not so much because I was burned out from the classroom, because if you have my teachers will that work with know that I'm very passionate and work with them, I'll jump in a lesson immediately. You can probably tell from the passion here. But it really was about I wanted to do more to educate new teachers and help them develop. And I wanted to expand that, you know, just that information so we able to have the classrooms that are more holistic, classrooms that inspire our young people. So that's why I switched from teaching young people to working with teachers and be able to do that. So we're looking at those different perspectives. So I just wanted to, I just realized I didn't say hi.